Laura, how's it going? Good, how are you? I'm doing good. Good. So if we want to just jump right into the interview, I have a few yeah, questions sure. prepared. Yeah, sure. Awesome. So the first question I have prepared is, how long have you been a business owner? Uh, 25 years. This is our, this is our 25th year anniversary right now. So, um, we've, we've had, I've had, I started Big Dipper in 1995. Awesome. Yeah. And how has the virus affected your business and employees? Sure. Well, at, well, first business slowed down quite a bit and we were open for about the first week when things really hit. And then it, we realized it was, we needed to shut everything down to just kind of evaluate things and give it a rest so unfortunately we got had to lay off everybody for a few weeks um our ice cream maker was still working and she's making ice cream for grocery stores and then i have a couple of managers that we've kept on that we've been that are still working so uh, but um we did okay so anyway to answer your question we had to shut down for a few weeks and um now we're gradually coming back a little bit Okay, awesome. Is your ice cream truck and your wholesales, are they still functioning or? No, the truck is not probably going to be doing anything until, you know, maybe if they get out to lunch or downtown tonight running something like that. Otherwise, it probably will be sitting there for a little bit. Um, and the wholesale, um, other than the grocery stores, we're not selling to anybody because it's all restaurant business. So, um, but we have been working with the bridge a little bit and they're selling some of our pints with their community delivery. So that's been kind of cool. Oh, awesome. And how, how many people were working for you and how many are now? Um, we had, oh, maybe 30 or so people working, maybe a little bit less. Um, cause we have a lot of part-time people and a lot of, um, we have high school kids, you know, making waffle cones and things like that. Um, it, but um, uh, what was the second part of that question? How many are working for you now? Oh, right now um, we have um, one, two, uh, four or five people right now. Yeah. But it's all changing pretty rapidly. We're trying to ramp things up a little bit. Yeah. So what are you thinking your next steps are and how do you plan to reopen? Right. Okay. Well, on Monday we um, started doing online and phone um, orders. So you can go to our website and you can go to our square store and, you, and we have a limited menu, um, but you can order ice cream that way or call down and then people are able to pick it up kind of a, like a contact free pickup. And we also are doing Uber Eats. And we had that off for a while too, and, and we're gonna turn that back on. So we'll be using that as well. Um, so for the next, probably, I would say at least a couple of weeks, we'll keep doing that. And then we'll try to transition back into scooping at some point when um, some more restrictions are lifted. That's awesome. And what's, or have you received any sort of community support or do you feel like there's anything helping local businesses right now? Tons. Well, you guys calling to interview us is huge. Um, the news reporting on what's going on is really nice. And it feels to me like you really feel this really nice small community working together where other businesses are, um, you know, mentioning each other on Instagram and Facebook and things like that. And everybody's really trying to support each other by spending their money locally or buying gift cards. So we're seeing that people have been buying gift cards online from us and, and just a lot of um, people seem really happy that we're trying to get open again a little bit and we're doing it really carefully. Last time when, before we closed, it was a little chaotic because the weather was nice, you know, and we're trying to keep people separated in the line and it was a little chaotic. So we kind of are rebooting it now with uh, um, a little more caution and care, I would say. That's awesome. Well, that's all the questions I have for you. Thanks so much for doing this interview. Yeah, I appreciate it. It's nice to meet you, Flora. Nice to meet yeah, you. Yeah, if, yeah, if you need anything else, let me know. But Thank yeah, you so happy much. to talk to you. Everything. Thanks so much. All right, bye-bye.